I've got an amazing hearing technology that I wanna share with you guys today. If you have hearing loss, you know the challenge isn't just hearing better at home, it's trying to follow a conversation at a noisy airport, understanding an announcement at church, or enjoying a live performance at a theater. That's why people are excited about a new Bluetooth LE audio technology called AuraCast. It's a major addition to Bluetooth connectivity offerings and a shift in how people with hearing loss experience the world around them. In this video, I'm going to show you what AuraCast is and walk you through three real life examples of how AuraCast is changing sound quality for individuals with hearing loss from public spaces to private listening so you can understand what's possible now and what's coming. I'm Dr. Ben Thompson, audiologist and founder of Treble Health. I've worked with hearing aids for over 10 years and run a nationwide private practice. So let's get into it. First, what is AuraCast? In 2022, the Bluetooth Special Interest Group introduced Bluetooth LE Audio, a major update to the decade-old Bluetooth standard. LE Audio brings improved sound quality, lower latency speed, and new features like multi-stream audio and AuraCast broadcast. AuraCast is a standout feature of LE Audio because it allows audio to be broadcast to multiple nearby devices at once, including hearing aids. And I have some hearing aids right here that I'm going to show you how this can really work. From the start, the hearing aid industry worked closely with Bluetooth Special Interest Group to help shape AuraCast, recognizing its enormous potential as an accessibility tool. And because AuraCast isn't just for hearing aids, it's also being integrated into smartphones, TVs, laptops, and public spaces. It's likely to see faster, broader adoption than older systems like Telecoil. Basically, AuraCast allows audio to be broadcast to multiple devices at once, kind of like how Wi-Fi works, where you I can be on my phone, my girlfriend can be on her iPad, you know, my mom visiting can be on her laptop. So that means your hearing aids can connect along with other people to live audio streams in public places or at home without extra equipment, syncing issues, or frustrations trying to pair your devices. Now I'll explain the three real life examples of how AuraCast can help you. Number three, public spaces like theaters and churches are finally going to feel more accessible. Let's start with the most public application of AuraCast, places where assisted listening used to be awkward or ineffective. Until now, many venues have relied on telecoil systems, an established technology that has provided meaningful support for people with hearing loss for decades. While effective in many situations, telecoils can have limitations, like variable sound quality or restricted seating zones. AuraCast, however, builds on that foundation by offering a more flexible and user-friendly solution that's easier to install and designed to reach more people more clearly. AuraCast changes this completely. It's part of Bluetooth LE Audio and lets your hearing aids connect wirelessly to a live audio stream just as easy as joining a Wi-Fi signal. That means crystal clear sound from any seat in the house. You see, many older adults have stopped going to live shows simply because they can't follow the dialogue, even with great hearing aids. But when a venue installs AuraCast, that experience will change completely with the push of a button. These hearing aids right here are made by a manufacturer called Resound, and with the Resound app, for example, Resound hearing aid users can open the AuraCast Assistant, tap to join the audio stream, and instantly feel like they have front row seats, even from the nosebleeds. There's no special equipment or AuraCast mobile device needed, no awkward requests, just effortless, press a button, and I can hear what I'm trying to hear. One of the best examples of this currently came from the Sydney Opera House where attendees can now connect using AuraCast. There's no wires. The Sydney Opera House has permanently implemented AuraCast broadcast audio technology in several of its venues and as of March 2025, AuraCast was live in the Opera House's drama theater playhouse and studio, making it the first major cultural institution globally to offer this advanced listening system for live performances. Hopefully, examples like this will spark adoption and implementation of AuraCast in the United States, especially since starting earlier this year, commercial AuraCast transmitters are now more readily available for venues to purchase. It will be exciting to hear what venues in the US will be announcing in the near future. All right, number two about how AuraCast can change hearing forever, 
real-time announcements in places like airports and train stations. Let's talk about places where you don't just want to hear well, you need to. Airports, train stations, convention centers, anywhere that you've had to kind of squint at a monitor or ask a stranger, what did that muffled speaker just say? These situations and, and environments consistently rank as some of the most challenging environments for people with hearing loss. Oracast lets these venues broadcast real-time announcements, boarding calls, gate changes, safety messages, straight into your hearing aids. And I believe this is massive for accessibility and independence. Many people with hearing loss experience anxiety while traveling, especially in busy airports where announcements are often muffled or drowned out by background noise. With Oracast enabled hearing aids, however, that experience can completely change. Instead of straining to hear gate changes or boarding calls, users can connect directly to the airport's audio broadcast through their hearing aids, hearing every announcement clearly and confidently. No more missed flights or asking strangers for help. The key here is that this isn't just the future, it's already starting to roll out with commercial Oracast transmitters now finally available for public venues, places like theaters, airports, and conference centers can start broadcasting audio directly to hearing aids. And as more spaces adopt this new standard, the listening experience for people with hearing loss will become more inclusive and effortless. I decided to have this video sponsored by Resound, one of the leaders in the hearing aid space, who's driving the Oracast revolution. Resound is a trusted manufacturer that has a reputation for driving connectivity in hearing aids. They were the first to connect to Apple iPhones back in 2014, and they believe everyone should benefit from the new Oracast technology, not just those buying premium devices. That's why they've made Oracast available in their latest product families from the new premium flagship Resound AI hearing aids, which I have right here, all the way down to the Essentials family, Resound Savvy, as well as Resound Nexia. They also built the world's first hearing aid app with an Oracast assistant, allowing you to search and join broadcasts, even if your smartphone doesn't yet support Oracast natively. With Resound, you don't have to wait on your phone's operating system. You're already ready for Oracast. I wanna show you what the newest Resound hearing aids look like in my hands and then on my ears. So right here you can see these devices and really how small they are and how they look. Um, this is the piece that goes up and behind the ear for the hearing aid. And you can see right here that there's one small button on there. So they do have some manual control options as well. That's the hearing aid, small, the smallest AI hearing aid that exists. And then we have this thin wire that goes alongside the skin. And then this is the small speaker inside of the ear canal with this rubber tip. I'll now show you what this looks like on my ear. So let's check it out. I've always found the Resound hearing aids to be comfortable and hardly noticeable. They're very lightweight and provide a great sound quality. If you'd like to try Resound's Oracast enabled hearing aids, click the link in the description below to start a risk-free trial of devices and find a local clinic near you. How it will work is you click that link and you'll be brought to a map where you'll put in your zip code and then you can find the clinics within a driving distance of your house and start that risk-free trial to see how much better this technology is and how it affects your quality of life. All right, number one on our list is personalized listening at home. The Oracast technology can really change how you watch TV, listen to music, and how your spouse or your family enjoys the home setting as well. So let's bring it home, literally. Because as powerful as Oracast is in public, its most impactful benefit might just be in your living room. Until now, streaming TV audio to hearing aids meant buying $300 proprietary accessories, and even then compatibility could be a mess. If you changed hearing aid brands, you had to buy a whole new setup. But Oracast ends that because direct broadcasting is now being built into your TVs, computers, and tablets, so you'll be able to stream audio wirelessly. No necklaces or accessories that will be needed. Many couples struggle with watching TV together when one partner needs louder volume and the other prefers it quieter. With Oracast-enabled hearing aids, 
and a compatible TV, that tension disappears completely. The user can connect privately to the audio stream, enjoying clear sound directly into their hearing aids, while everyone else in the room hears the volume that they would like to hear. It's a simple solution that brings comfort, clarity, and harmony back to those shared moments together in your living room. And that's one reason why Auracast is already becoming the new standard. It's starting to appear in smart TVs, and while Android phones like the Pixel 8 are beginning to support it, iPhones at the time of making this video don't quite yet, but that's expected to change soon. The good news, if your hearing aids are Auracast enabled now and you have an Auracast app assistant like those from Resound, you'll be ready to connect as smartphones and public venues quickly catch up in the months and years to come. So guys, I want you to know that Orcast is not some far off future. It's here right now and it's reshaping how people with hearing aids hear the world. From public venues to watching TV at home, from sermons at the church to hearing your airport announcements, this technology is a game changer and it's only going to become more popular. And the best part, with hearing aids like the Resound that I mentioned, you're not just hearing better today, but you're future-proofed for everything that tomorrow will bring. And as you know, technology moves fast. I expect the Auracast to move quickly here. If this helps you understand what to look for in your next hearing aid, hit that like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel here, Travel Health, for more expert-backed real-world advice. I'm Dr. Ben Thompson. Thanks for watching this video. And if you'd like to try any of the products mentioned, you can click the links on the screen or below. Thank you so much and take care.